I'm here in Italy. We've had a 10 day excursion and we've stayed in this amazing villa that's basically a mansion. From my point of view, my goodness, this has been the most amazing holiday ever. Where are we? This is Vico Equense, a suburb of Siena, which is on the Bay of Naples. Southern Italy is wonderful. The Amalfi Coast is wonderful. And now I fully understand why the Romans loved the Campania region. I don't want to leave. We've been here nine days of a 10 day holiday. I don't want to go home, but I know that we have to. Let's have a look around. place where you can buy drinks, drinks, snacks, snacks and drinks. We've come over here and it has uh, the essentials like water, batteries, deodorant, book plugs and vibrators. Cannabis. <laughs> what? Is cannabis legal here? Oh, that's... they're sweets. How are they? So... They're edibles. Oh, that'd be disappointing if actually what you wanted was marijuana and you just got a sweetie. No, you don't seem to understand, Jen. Edibles. Cannabis infused oh, sweets. Yeah. Kind of feels like sometimes when you talk to Jen, like she's already on edibles. Okay, we're going to start with the most important part of this tour. And that is the nice seating area that's outside under a shade by the massive, massive bar. This is not a joke. That is a full bar. Everything works. We've got beer on tap. We've got wines and all sorts in the fridges. Down the bottom we have beers in bottles and uh, soft drinks. My goodness, it is amazing. I have partaken of the spirits. I know that I'm not supposed to because uh, it's a bit of a liver issue. But you know what? I'm on holiday. A couple of days, I'll be fine. Wonderful area. Just sitting there. Even if you're not having a drink, just sitting there. Not being completely in the sunlight, but enjoying the heat has been wonderful. But what's even more wonderful is right next to it, next to the kumquat tree and the tangerine tree, is an open pizza place. We have our own outdoor pizza oven, make pizzas if you want. We did do an evening where we were actually taught by our host Francisco how to do it properly, the Italian way. My goodness, it was amazing. So, that was a lot of fun. Then I'm coming over here because it's more in shade. There's tangerine trees. Wonderful. This place is amazing. It's a, it literally is a mansion. So, now we're around the back. That little area where you can sit on an evening because the sun changes position. 
terraces with loads of seating areas. Fantastic. I would love to live here. I really would. I couldn't because the heat gets up a lot. You can already see I'm pink. That's because it's starting to get warm now. We are at the start of the season. We're basically, in order to make things work properly, we came just before the start of the season because I can't deal with the heat. So we've had a great time. It's been, I think the lowest temperature it's got is 20 degrees C and the highest, I don't know, because I was in the pool when it got that hot. Let's go back in. So now we're inside and we're in immediately in to a nice seating area. This on an evening has been wonderful. You get to see a great view of the Bay of Naples. Lovely seats to just sit on. It's like a sun room. But it's not only a sun room because just down on the other side is the dining room. Massive glass table. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Huge glass table with what must be the best view in the entire area. Here is Vico Aquense. And that huge thing there is Mount Vesuvius in the Bay of Naples. I could not have asked for a better view. This place is fantastic. Seriously, it is absolutely wonderful. It's great artwork on the walls, wonderful stuff. Roman pottery everywhere and it's just amazing. Now I'm a little bit dark because I am in the kitchen area. We haven't got the lights on at the moment because no one's using it. I've cooked many a meal in here. It's very, very nice. Not quite as large for the kitchen area as uh, my kitchen at home, but everything is so well placed that you don't even notice when, you, when you're cooking. Brilliant. Got the hob, very nice. Over there, we've got the uh, oven in the corner. So everything's out of the way of everything else, which means that you don't feel like, even if there's two or three people in here helping you out, like you're crowded, which is great. This is where we've been mainly living. It's the breakfast bar area, technically. But what it actually is, is right next to a cup of tea and a coffee machine and a nice area to just sit. So I've spent a fair amount of time here. But if sitting and enjoying yourself is what you want, we've got a nice sliding door. And then we come into the huge living space. Wonderful. There it is. Wonderful uh, glass table. Haven't touched it, haven't dared. It is delicate. Huge uh, cabinets and sideboards. Loads of examples of amazing Roman pottery. Fantastic piano. And then multiple sitting areas. You want to sit and just look out the window and enjoy things? Great. If you want to sit and enjoy a, a film with the family? Great. You can do all that. This has been amazing. I could not have asked for better. But we go back out here. Up there is the upstairs, of course. But I want to show you that because a bedroom's a bedroom's a bedroom. And let's face it, I am a bit messy. I haven't really tidied up while I've been here because we've been too busy. We've got to tidy up before we go, of course. But <laughs> the main thing I've saved for last because my guys, the pool. How good is that? It's a full pool, not Olympic size, but big enough that uh, if you do a few laps, you do feel the burn. And how could I end this video without doing a stunt jump into the water? Well, this is a very expensive camera and I've got a lot of very expensive equipment attached to it. So I'm not gonna jump in with this camera. Cue the action cam. I'm not kidding. Let's do this. I don't know how much of that you got, but I enjoyed it. <laughs> I have absolutely adored every minute that we've been here. It's difficult to swim while holding a camera, so perhaps I should do it on my back. I have enjoyed every single minute of every single day that we've been here. And you know what? If someone said, do you want to come back? Yeah, straight away. No problem whatsoever. It has been wonderful. I've enjoyed every single minute of it. And I recommend if you get the chance, you come here too. Take care, guys. See you tomorrow.
If you like the show, please consider supporting me on Patreon. It really does help create future videos. That's patreon.com slash Zoe Kirk Robinson. And I've got an extra special thanks going out to Chief89, Sam Yates, Retro Mickey82, Mo Henry, and George Botterini. Thank you so much, guys.